Uh, thanks for having me on your show. Are you kidding me? No. I. <laughs> Yeah, see, you're funny. Yeah, it's my thing. So you were hanging out with Reese, yeah. and is it true that she <laughs> like just had cracks and, and she ribs me? Ribs? Tell me how. I met her at a party, and she immediately started making fun of the shoes I was wearing, and uh, <laughs> and she said to my wife, she was like, "So you just let her leave the house wearing these shoes?" <laughs> and. She just goes in. We were at the, on the red carpet the other night, and she turned to me, and she said, you have cat hair all over your <laughs> jacket. And it, to be fair, it was true. Um, but that's what I'm looking for uh, in a relationship, whether it's my wife or friends or anybody. I love a good ribbing. OK, so you're on the morning show. Yeah. I, I actually have a professional question. Oh, yeah. Which is, how are you I'm very so tiny. natural and dry and good and scene stealing and funny and confident? Like, how do you do it? Drew, first of all, you're kind. Second of all, um, when directors come up, when I see a director walking my way and I'm like, oh, they're going to give me a note, I immediately stop them and say, before you say anything, I have no range. But go ahead, what were you, what were you gonna say? You're a stand-up. What is it like for you? Because you're, you have these loyal audiences and- Yeah, I love it. I absolutely love being in front of a live audience. And um, nothing makes me happier, it makes me so happy. So I hope you love your job. Thank you, and I'm so attached to it. <laughs> And I get to be the kind of parent I want to be. I get to That's have awesome. this life with my kids, you That's know, awesome. and our little ecosystem and our animals. Speaking of, you had cat hair on the carpet. Yeah. Um, on the red carpet. Yeah. On every carpet on I go on. I, on this carpet, I have cat hair. You have, your cat has an Instagram. Yeah. How did that come about? <laughs> I mean, what? No! <laughs> I started the Instagram account because uh, I just uh, wanted to look at my cat all the time. And uh, a woman from Iowa started following my account. So I just started posting pictures for her. I don't think she was even following me. It was just <laughs> my cat. And then I did a show with Kevin Nealon, and I showed him my cat. And then he was like, oh, that's Tig's Instagram handle. So he tagged me, and now I have more fo followers. And I never, I don't want to be verified. I don't care about any of that. <laughs> After I got so many people looking at it, I just started promoting my stuff, and my cat barely shows up now. Listen. I'm embarrassed to say. Well, you shouldn't be. And actually, in honor of Fluff, I have something for you that I've recently discovered. So, thank you so much. So, this is this new thing I've discovered. Um, and I, I do want to demonstrate how okay. it works. Do you mind? Okay. No. So, okay. Oh. So, what you want to do is. Oh, my God. And gosh. I'm not kidding. I brought my cat, Peach. <laughs> in it, and then you fasten it in the back. It's very stable. Okay. And what you do is you put your cat in here. And in fact, here. Here, we stand up. Okay, so this thing is not only for cat, but it's also for two other reasons I'm finding. It's to ensure that you never find a partner. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> you or, or you find your exact perfect partner <laughs> that is like. <laughs> um, I have three cats, so could I get two more of these? Yes, absolutely, okay. Tig. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Tig Nataro.